Welcome back to the industrial section, polluted as it is, of uh, Valhalla. City Skylines After Dark, Tenacious Viking, your mayor host. Well, we got this interchange built last time, and I think it's working. Uh, let's take a look at the traffic flow here. Yeah, see, that's much better now. It's much more evenly dispersed. This is still a hot pocket here, but that's because of the railroad uh, station. If I had thought better about it, I might have turned that around and, and had the trucks drive in from right here. But, um, you know, I'd like to have the option for trucks from small businesses and so on to come in. Oh, don't I have water here? Uh-oh. 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 I do not. A serious water problem on here. I thought I had done a oh, a better job of that, bringing this out here. Shame on me. Well, today I have another surprise for you. Last time we built a prison, uh, an Alcatrazian. <laughs> wow, I just made up a new term. Uh, kind of an Alcatraz thing. Let's see how I want to do this here. See, I think we can cut this one off right. Oh, come on. There. Okay. So I got curious one day, came in here unannounced quietly. Doing a little experiment. And the experiment worked beyond my belief. What's this? Yeah. And here was the experiment. I just reached across here like so. And built me a dam. Just like that. Is that cool or what? And then of course once you build that. I can get this to go. Come on. Come on. You have got yourself. A little road. does this do for us? Well, this puppy produces a lot of power. 64 megawatts. Now, I don't think... Yeah, it's right now it's not connecting. But, oh. But I 
we run this across here. And oh, what the heck? Let's just. Oh, no, I want to run it across this too. <laughs> And we hook that up and look at our electrical production now. And boom. Come on. It's a good fire now. Stupid thing. See, it should be higher than that. I think it will come up. Plus, it gives us a bridge across the river. Over to this section. How cool is that? I wonder if I need water. Do I need to bring water over to that? I probably do, huh? I don't <clears throat> know that I need to do this, and I'm not really sure why I should have to do this. But I'm going to anyway, just to be sure and to get that started. <clears throat> okay, so this is producing 64, oh, 45. Kind of flex, kind of flexes, doesn't it? See, when I did it before, I had all kinds of power all of a sudden. And now, not so much. I skewed this a little bit to make it easier to hook up this road. Um, maybe I should have. I don't know, but I did. Sue me. So I may have loaded the... Uh, the potential of the dam a little bit, maybe? I don't know. Possibly. Well, I was hoping that would give me enough power. And I may do it anyway, for now anyway. I'd like to move a couple more, a couple of the windmills, uh, wind turbines, over to Alcatraz. Uh, but apparently this has enough power, I guess. So, I won't worry about it. I am, however, then going to move... a couple of these turbines from here. Uh, more over to here. Because I don't like them that close to buildings and stuff. I think that's annoying. So, let's do that. I think we can find some spots here. Maybe one more. <clears throat> Just to get a little farther away from the populace. There, that's a little better. And that may give us an option for something in here at some point. I don't know. Now, I'd like to see if... Uh, okay, that's... This one maybe is empty by now? Emptying is finished. Okay, so I can move this. Just right up. Really? I can't do... really don't want to do one here, but I will. Okay, now can I put it, another one in here? Boy, that's dumb. Why can't I move that after it's emptied, for crying out loud? Okay. <clears throat> now, is this one still registering as, a, as an empty... Yeah, 
Okay, this one is still in empty mode, so now we're going to fill it again. Okay. And that should also give me... <coughs> should allow me to remove these. Okay. And I, I am. I'm just going to... I'm just going to bulldoze those. Um, get them out of there. Why isn't it empty? It said it was empty. I thought it said it was empty. It's 13% full. Okay. I like this, the way this works, because it gives this road a purpose now. Uh, we can come over here. We can actually build some houses right along the dam and right along the river here, maybe. Because um, I'd put housing on this side. This side over here is going to end up being um, pretty industrial. <clears throat> Then the question becomes, what do I do with this area in here? Because this is kind of a mess now. I've got the uh, the, oh, the dirt road and the uh, landfills in here. But this road ends up here. Then I got this curve here. I'd kind of like to line that up. So we need to do something. Um, and eventually we're going to... See, right now, I'd, if I were to expand industrial, I would just extend this across here and, and do it over here. But, gosh, I don't want to have that many weird intersections and stuff. I don't know. Um, it's a puzzle. <clears throat> Nobody ever said city planning was going to be easy. I do now, however, have two six-lane roads going into this section here. Uh, this area typically is what I'll end up using for things like a stadium and a concert venue and stuff because you can get to it pretty easily. But I don't know if that's a good idea right next to the railroad track. And, you know, th this probably should be uh, more of a more of a uh, industrial area. Not that there's a lot of room for industry there. And I can squeeze some in here. I have to either bring the railroad underneath. I'll probably have to do that. Or bring the road over. Doesn't leave me much access to this. But, oh well. Then the long-term plan is... Um, we got this highway to bring this up here and put another one of these specialty intersections in right about in the middle here and then angle it over and hook this up with another probably hand-built interchange since I can't get any of the prefab ones to work worth a hoot uh. so what I probably should do is pick a oh geez I, I don't know if I can do that until I get this in here um, I guess maybe pick a spot right about here and connect these two. That's what I need to do. Because I have to, I have to make that that connection. But right now I need to zone some residential over here before people get mad and give up and go somewhere and move in somewhere else. I don't know if they do that or not. I don't think they do, but... Uh, and I'm going to go to the big paint tool and do a bunch of this. Why is that blotchy like that? I don't know if that's any faster. I don't think it is.
Now the next growth spur in this city will, uh... Create, uh... Oh, I'll get the, uh, the tourist, uh, dock, too, won't I, when I get, uh, same time I get the cargo. Uh, um, that will be cool. So I'm just going to go ahead and fill this in for commercial because I'm not, I mean, what else am I going to do with it? And I think this might as well be commercial along here too, huh? commercial because that view wasn't that great for those houses <laughs> that's one nice thing about being able to go in and see what that looks like and I think since we have s high uh, high density residential here we'll fill this in with residential as well these power lines gonna have to I can get, I can take some of those out pretty soon but that's the main power line down to here so well maybe I will be able to take them out when they connect along here We'll have to see. That would be cool. Um, I was all excited about building a pedestrian bridge across here, but nobody's using the one over at the university, so I don't see why I should make another one. See, nobody ever uses this. Take the bus. I thought people would be using this a lot. And they are not. And I'm not sure why. Maybe if. Uh, is there a bus station here? Well, even if there isn't, they can. If there's a bus right in front of the university, they can take that. Take the stupid pedestrian bridge across and get to it. That's kind of what it's there for. So that's a disappointment. But what is this now? Garbage is piled up. Oh, they can't get in to take out the garbage. Well, utility trucks are supposed to be able to get in on the pedestrian roads. Or do we have a whole major garbage problem? See, they, they can get in here. If, if utility vehicles can get in, why can't garbage trucks? That's dumb. I don't understand that. Let me see what the budget is like for uh, for that. Maybe we need to bring that up. No, it's 100%. We'll have to keep an eye on that. We may have to change that into a road. But I'm still not sure that's going to make a difference. I mean, it would be dumb to have to do a, a, uh, a road in there just for that purpose. Now, what is... There's some pedestrians there now. See, I thought by having high density residential here, there'd be a lot of people who either either students or staff at the college, and uh, and they would just walk over to the university. But uh, that's not happening, and this isn't working out very well either. So.
So we may have to reevaluate that. We'll have to keep an eye on it. All right. Um, meanwhile, our fledgling tourist industry here. Um, I'd like to see when the uh, sun comes up if any of these jet skis go out. There's a few people roaming about. Don't see any jet skis going out though. Let's uh, check out the fishing fishing pier. There's a few fisher, fishermen, fisher people. But I don't see... Oh, the game's going to crash. <laughs> yep. Well, that's a good time to quit. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Join me next time when once again Tenacious Viking plays City Skylines After Dark.